Well, hi everyone, Bob Gower of BobCanHelp.com and um, today in this little series we are introducing you to a series of definitions, uh, concept definitions from the Entrepreneur's Guide to Customer Development, a great new book that has just come out. Go pick up a copy over at CustDev.com. Um, today the concept we're going to talk about is minimum viable product. Now this is a, um, as, a as an agilist or as, a, as an agile proponent, this is a concept that's very near and dear to my heart. and. What, what do you think of when you think about minimum viable product? It's really the smallest product that you can sell to your customer. Some people call it sometimes minimum sellable product. Sometimes we call it minimum releasable product. Sometimes we parse a little bit between those definitions about exactly what they mean. But really what we're talking about is we're thinking about a product as a collection of features. So now let's talk about a collection of, um, actually elsewhere on this blog I've discussed this, but the idea is that it's a product with the fewest number of features needed to achieve a specific objective and users are willing to pay in the form of some scarce resource. Now that scarce resource could be time or money or attention. Generally those are the, the resources that we're looking to get people to pay at. But what you want to think about is you want to think about a feature of your product, whether it's a physical product or a software product, but any feature of that product, any benefit it delivers as an encapsulated piece of business value. And then what you want to do is you want to collect up what's the smallest set of those features that you could actually package together into a viable product and get out there into market, the marketplace and sell. Now, um, in the customer development methodology, which is what we're talking about here, we actually package up what we think is our minimum viable product on several, in several different ways, and then we get it out there and we sort of ask the market, like, hey, do you want this? And then see what the market says. So it's sort of a scientific method of questioning of the market. Again, the book that we're talking about is The Entrepreneur's Guide to Customer Development. You can get it now over at custdev.com. My name is Bob Gower. You can follow me on Twitter at Bob Gower. You can also visit my blog at bobcanhelp.com. Feel free to drop me a line. Let me know how I can help. Thanks for tuning in.